What's up tribe? Thank you for being here and welcome to my channel. This will be a general reading for Scorpio, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. And we're using a mix of the Enchanted Map Oracle cards with the Good Tarot, both by Colette Baronade for this reading. Scorpios, I already recorded this reading and I started uploading it. And while it was uploading, I was inclined to take a second look at that Hierophant card to find out that um, I was wrong when I was counting the points of the star because I thought it was a nine-pointed star which was an Enneagram uh, that was a model of human psyche and personality types that was used by uh, both in business and in spirituality. And I was saying it was the Enneagram of personality has been widely promoted in both business management and spirituality context through seminars, conferences, books and magazines and that it is more commonly presented as a path to higher states of being, essence, and enlightenment. Both contexts say it can aid in self-awareness, self-understanding, and self-development. And I was saying that you were taking a deep dive into your unconscious to find out the truth of that, if any of these personality types were what you were if any of these personality types defined you or described you in any way to later realize that it's an eight-pointed star so i started my research about the eight-pointed star and i got to the seal of solomon or khatam suleiman and all the stories about it and the interpretation of it by all different uh, cultures and it's about hope and resurrection and a, a lot but none of that like I was saying okay so let's reverse so I was saying that the three of cups by the traditional tarot is usually depicts three women raising their cups up in celebration and that's not what I got from this this is somebody who's going nope not this not that and not that either none of these are good enough and and i'm having none of it and that's exactly what she is saying and that's exactly how i felt after i was looking up the eight pointed star meanings none of it none of these explanation it's not about the seal of solomon it's not about no 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 not about a fish and a ring and it's not none of that the hierophant card is usually a man uh, it's in some decks it's named the pope and it represents Uh, it, and it stands for tradition, convention, teacher or a teacher or a counselor who may help the quarant in learning and education. So, and I was saying this is not a traditional depiction. This is not a traditional hierophant because one, she's a woman and then there's no no pillars no it's different she's bringing a different way of looking at things and when i was looking the eight pointed star it just hit me who better to ask than matthias de stefano a man with a vivid memory of many past lifetimes he has a new show on Gaia. And then when I was watching the video, I realized this is, this is his symbol. This is the, 
this is his logo and that's what she's presenting she's presenting his teachings as the new way of looking and interpreting and understanding life in the three of water she's saying none of these ideologies none of these concepts are good enough this is the one and that's how I feel about Matthias de Stefano. That is it. That makes complete and total sense. The Hierophant and the High Priestess are people who have access to both sides of the veil. They can see through. Um, they can see through things. They can see through their lies that uh, that are presented to us in forms of these traditional establishments and she's saying nope no more of that this is this is the truth this is this is the new way of looking at things And um, she has huge, huge, massive spiritual support on this one. And she's bringing it to the light. She's bringing, she's bringing Matthias de Stefano's teachings to the light. The card also tells me that not everything is black and white. Look at how much grey there is in the card. Not everything is as black and white as it seems. The devil card in the ter traditional tarot d does this mudra, I think. Or is it? I'm not sure what the mudra is. But it means what you see is all there is. And that's the biggest lie and she is saying no no I know that that's not the truth because I can see both sides of the veil the queen of water okay so taking a deep dive taking a deep dive is only where the stout hearted tread it's priceless because as Carl Jung states, in the shadow lies the gold. What he means is that confronting the shadow and all its unpleasantness lead to the gold of psychological integrity. And so she's going, she's taking a deep dive into her unconscious. What am I believing about myself that is not me? That is what people see. I am not who you think I am. I am not who I think I am. I am who I think you think I am. So to what extent is that what I'm thinking and believing about myself? Because it's not the truth. And I'm taking a deep dive into my psyche to find my true soul's song to find my light look at all the blue this is all about truth communication throat chakra self-expression i'm looking for my own expression of self what is what does this frequency set what is my pure frequency untethered by others opinions of me what's my soul's song And once I find that, I am going to protect it because that's my essence. And, and to me, that's just pure consciousness. Anything else is just added onto you. What you are is consciousness. Period. Point blank. And so she's walking away from all this gold. She, this card depicts pearls this card depicts gold and what i'm getting from this is that she's walking away from physical 
um, physical representations of abundance and <laughs> don't mind the hangman he's just pining over her he's flipping and and hanging himself upside down to take a better look at her singing her souls singing her soul's true song but she's going on an adventure the messenger fire here says the messenger of fire says determination for a new adventure innovation independent creative action spirited headstrong i have an unstoppable spirit and can co-create all that i desire surrounded by spirit Illumined by the wisdom that rises up within me, I set forth on a path to innovate. I trust my vision and I act accordingly, remaining true to what I most value and desire, which can manifest in many forms. That is all I have for you, Scorpio. Thank you for joining me. If you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up share subscribe if you want to be part of the channel and i'll see you next time until then i'm sending you my love and i'm hoping you stay safe bye for now